Hey, what's going on guys? Today's video, I'm gonna be showing you what's going on with these hashtags above the title on YouTube videos. Forgive me, uh, this is an advertisement on one of my videos. I don't wanna play it, obviously. I don't want Google to think I'm trying to watch my own ads. But what I'm talking about is right up here, you've probably seen only a few vloggers tech reviewers, et cetera, do this. I thought this was a special beta program. You're seeing three hashtags. I've only seen three show up. Now, these are legitimate. Anyone can do them. A quick Google search for me yielded the results, so I'm making my own video for you. Google does want you to be very specific to your niche or niche. If you're a vlogger, use vlog vlogger. If you are a tech reviewer and you're using travel vlogging, it's probably going to be taken down. I will go ahead and link the actual Google page talking about all of the requirements. It can't be two separate words. The words have to be together and you have to put hashtag. You can use up to 15 any more than that and they'll ignore the hashtags and over tagging they actually might remove your video. You don't want that or they might re remove your video from search. You definitely don't want that. You can't have any of the following above, hate speech, sexual content, vulgar language, non-hashtags, meaning like scrambled of keywords in your description box, like, hey, I'm reviewing the DJI Mavic, 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 Phantom 3, Phantom 4, Phantom 5, Phantom 6, Apple Watch, etc. You know, you, it has to be fluid, but you can use up to 15 hashtags in your description box but only three will show above the video title right here. This is my first video that I've done this on, and I'm doing it on my tech channel as well. Let me show you how to do it. All right, forgive me, I'm covering up my keywords because they're very specific, and I wanna keep other people from making copies of mine. Anyway, the description box you're looking at right behind this piece of paper here, that little description box, obviously, right there. You wanna to scroll to the very bottom, hit enter a couple times to get some spacing in between your last paragraph or email address or social media, whatever you're linking in there. So for instance, with me, I have my email address, business inquiries, I use a couple spaces, and then I only have three. I will experiment with more, but obviously only three show up above the title of the video. So again, one word, hashtag, one word, space, hashtag, the next word, space, the hashtag, the next one. Again, Google says you can add up to 15. Just make sure you don't go above that. So coming over here, you're like, what's the point of even doing that? Well, let's go ahead and click on the first one here and it comes up to the page right here. Hashtag in the search box, very cool. Now these ones obviously are bigger channels. The Speedy Diver is huge, over 1 million subscribers, so obviously he's gonna come up before I am, but I'm trying to cash in on the party and use those to my advantage to bring in more viewers searching for those specific hashtag or keyword. So far, it's so new, only a few months old. Time will tell what it truly means when people pick through it, talk to executives at YouTube for precise what it does for your channel and what does it mean. Anyway, I'm showing you how to do it. Hopefully it has helped. Smash that like button and always stay tuned for more videos on this channel. YouTube related DIY projects, house projects. You guys get the idea. I'll see you in the next one. And if you're wondering, my other channel is linked in the description box below for that hashtag. We'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye.